it's Paola. Welcome back to my art and graphic design channel. I am so excited today because I am talking about Adobe Express and I'm working with Adobe on this video and oh, it just feels like a dream come true. If you don't know what Adobe Express is, it's basically their app. So I have it on my phone, my iPad, and it is like all the Adobe programs, but like miniature on my phone. So I can just do things so quick and easy, especially for like social media. If you don't follow me on social media, what are you doing? Because that's where I'm like trying out Adobe Express the most, especially because they have like Instagram story features. They have Instagram post features. They have so many different like templates and starting points and it's free to use. Like right now you could download it and use it. It's free for everyone, but you also get a premium subscription already. If you have the creative cloud, I personally love it because there are so many different things you can do on there, like even creating logos and creating like YouTube thumbnails, things like that. But it's really like an addition to my design work, honestly, because I have the Adobe suite, obviously, and I'm using it all the time. But then when I'm doing things quicker, especially for social media, now I can kind of just like make a quick Instagram story or make even my YouTube thumbnails on mobile now. But there are like quick actions, which I really love, where you can just pop on the app and take a photo and it can remove the background for you so easy, which, you know, sometimes you don't want to like get out your laptop, do all these things like that's what I'm loving about it is that I can just use it like in addition really quick, airdrop myself, like all those things just really quickly with my design work already. I can also use like my CC libraries where I have like some Pantone colors, some assets from other projects and like you can just bring that in. It's so easy. So I have been using it like to create my YouTube thumbnails, to create this YouTube thumbnail. Like I took myself a picture of myself and I dragged it in and hit remove background and it did it for me. So this is pairing with my work really well because I'm able to like create projects on the Adobe Creative Cloud, but then I'm also using that to post on social media, like post what I'm working on or create these thumbnails. I think it's really a great compliment to a lot of your work, especially if you are a freelance designer, like posting on social media about your work or, you know, you're advertising that you're like taking clients, things like that. Like these templates are so great to just like start off on, but you can also like create your own stuff. It's just like my favorite editing way now. You can even like utilize it with a content scheduler on there, like when you're putting out your posts. So it really, I feel like helps a lot of like designers, artists who want to get their work out there in general on social media. I feel like it's just like the perfect pairing for the rest of your work. Okay, so I just wanted to show you some templates that are really exciting to me to use on social media. Things like this are so cute because they have just small design elements that you might not necessarily be like creating yourself. Um, something like this is amazing. It's like removing background, like poster style. You can really like get into advertising your work. And I'm actually gonna use one of these to post on my Instagram to talk about like what's coming up next for me as a designer. So that's really exciting. I feel like it's fun to like make just little graphics and announcements this way, especially if you're a freelancer. Like, look how cute this is. I just really feel like you can really utilize this alongside your design work to create really easy and quicker business stuff. And even like, just if you're an artist, like showcase your work with cool stuff. And I know a lot of these have like very specific styles, but you can really like play with it, use your own photos and just start using it in the way that you would do it. So I also wanted to show you what you could do with your iPad if you have one. So there are also like worksheets you can open on here, which I think are really cool. And you could also share these on social media, but also like you can just use them for yourself as like fun creative prompts. And I also wanted to show you how they have a content calendar where you can actually schedule out the posts that you make on here. And that's currently on the web app. But yeah, I really hope that you download it and try it too because I'm loving it so much and it's free. Like it's totally low stakes, guys. This is just like the coolest thing. I wanted to highlight it, talk about some other ways to design because I know personally I do things very me style and I feel like we all are just figuring it out, doing our own thing. So like, why not add this to like the way you design, you know? So thank you so much for watching and download Adobe Express and I will see you in my next video. Please give this a like if you liked it. It really helps my channel and my videos and hopefully gives me more opportunity to talk about cool things like this and I will see you in the next one. Okay, bye! I got a haircut guys. Do you like it? Let me know. <laughs>